Lincoln here from Lampfish TV. We're out at a little brimming spot. I got, who's that? Ryan with me. And gonna try with plastics today. So I got a heap of different colours here in the, the two inch from Jiggle Fishing. Got the two and a half inch one as well. This is actually one of your favourite colour, which is a green speck. I've got that in the little ones, which I'm gonna use today. Yeah, I also got a few hard bodies, Atomic and Pro Lure and things like that. A couple of service lures. Well, I'm not really going to try the surface source today, but yeah, I've got some hard bodies there in case they're not hitting the plastics. So, hopefully we can get them to bite on something. Not too bad, it's spitting a bit today, but we've got to do what we've got to do. Sit out there. Geez, the water's nice and clear. Hopefully this is going to be awesome. Well, first one for the plastic. <laughs> it's a good one as well. net for this one. Only running six pound line on this little thing. There we go. Nice brim on the plastics. So that's on the green spec on a hidden weight system. Nice brim. First brim for the day goes to the plastics. Oh, yeah, buddy. oh it's a donkey! Oh. This one's pretty big. It's going under the kayak. Oh there he is. Yeah. Oh, not massive. He looked bigger, I swear. Still a good one. Oh, no, it is a big one. It's a good one. That's a really good one. So, this is one chunky brim. See you later, buddy. Go on. So, it took us probably an hour to find a fish. Now that we have, um, pretty much casting out, giving it a couple of jiggles like that, letting it sink, giving it a pause, jiggles again, bit of a wind, and then you're feeling the tap tap and you're on. Not obviously every single cast, but when you hook up, it's great fun. Rain, rain, go away, come again another day. Rain's just about to come, it's starting to spit. Some nice dark clouds around. Hopefully, it doesn't turn the fish off. It's been good so far. So, hopefully, we can just keep it going. But yes, hopefully, that rain does hold off a bit. Just so we can get a little bit more fishing in. So, I reckon I'm going to change over to watermelon. See if that one catches me some brim. So sometimes when I'm fishing for rim, I re actually really like using hidden weights in the jig heads. I just feel like it makes it look more natural and catches me more fish. So something worth trying if you use a norm normal jig head and they're looking at not hooking up, try one of the hidden weight ones because often they can change things. So the watermelon works. There we go. Watermelon doing the deed. Check it out. See you later, buddy. Well, change over to the galaxy. 
see if we can get this one onto a brim. So we've got, oh, we've got a double hook up here. Huh? Ryan's over there on a fish, and now I'm over here on a fish. I just changed over the little two, two inch galaxy one. Smashing that galaxy. <laughs> it's a nice fish. So I've drifted this area a couple of times, caught quite a few fish. So now I'm going to change over to the hard body, go back up there, drift it again, and see if they're going to chomp on that. So I'm going to use this clear little atomic thing. No idea what model or anything, but a little brim lure. Go on special anaconda <laughs> for like five bucks. So I thought, give it a try. See if I can catch as many on this as I did on the plastics just then. Be interesting to see. First one for the hard bodies, just when I was about to give up on them. <laughs> Little jackrabbit. Little atomic worked as well. Had to put in a lot more work with the hard body than I did with the plastic, so they might want something that's really slow sinking. So I've got a really light jig head on the other one. Nice little bimbo. Just pop that hook out. Just sitting in there. See you, bud. Hard body is picking up a hell of a lot more weed than the little placky was. Yeah, too much hard work for me with the hard bodies. Getting too much weed, it's annoying me. Gonna go back to the plastics. But I might actually change the color and see if another color works as well. Sometimes color really does play a big part in catching fish. So now I'm gonna try the Phantom. Has a big UV pigment in it. So it should be half decent. More slippery now because of that fish. We'll get this one on and see if we can catch something. Well, little two inch in Phantom has done the job. Pop that out. We can go back, buddy. So what's next? I reckon I'm gonna try the pearl color. Just a little puppy here. So, pop this one on. See if I can do it again. Righto, pearly pearl. It's your time to shine. Yep, there we go. First cast. And I've got a big bit of weed. Well, I'm struggling a little bit to pick up a brim on this white one. So that's interesting. Just hasn't been happening for the white one at all. Okay, giving up on the white color. I'm gonna go back to the green spec. Start smashing them again. Here we go, all ready for action. Bigger one? There's a one with a lot of energy. It's gonna make me do another turn, isn't it? It's a great thing about this kayak, you can stand up and turn around, do what you need. Come here, buddy. Good size. <laughs> Chomped it. See you later, mate. Now because it did start off nice and windy and it was about to rain, I didn't have my normal charger in the camera so didn't get that many hookups on camera. 
did start it after I hooked up and we caught quite a few fish. It was great fun. Nice little local spot. I'm not going to tell you the name of it, but I have filmed here before. So if you sift through the videos that I've got, you'll manage to find it. But it was great fun on that little rod. And it was great fun to get a bunch on plastics. Uh, plastics were working a fair bit better than the hard bodies. Tried the hard body from Atomic for a while, but it just wasn't getting the amount of hits and fish that the plastics were today. Sometimes that's fishing. Sometimes they'll hit hards more than they'll hit soft, but you just got to adjust the, to the conditions and go with it. Anyway, check out jigglefishing.com.au for the plastics and I'll see you next time. Green spec, just getting the job done.